Hello friends, welcome to Sherry's Life. The ears that I am wearing, I made for our last Disney cruise. And I have had a ton of comments on them on our other channel, Leg Life. So today I thought I would show you how I made them. So here is what you will need. I got these on Amazon. I will include that link below. They're just blank Mickey ears. Need some rope, some nautical themed ribbon, some scissors, some super glue, some scotch tape, a Sharpie, and then you probably can't see these, but it's just these little rubber bands. So step one, I am just going to cut off the tags off of the ears. Now cutting off the tags, there's always this little stripe of the tag left on the side. So I just color it in with a Sharpie and then you can't even see it. Next, we're gonna work on our bow just to get it glued. So you just wanna kind of measure about where you want your bow to go and then a little more than double that length is what you're gonna do. And then you just fold it over and then I just sort of accordion the edges so your bow kind of looks like that. And then I just kind of measure to make sure that's about where I want it to go. That looks good. So now I'm just gonna use one of the clear rubber bands. So the rubber band kind of keeps the accordion in place, but we're gonna put glue in there to make sure it's permanent. And let's put it in all the edges of the accordion. So while that is drying, we're just gonna set this off to the side and we're gonna work on the rope. So I got this from Joann's. They put scotch tape on the ends to keep the rope from fraying which is actually a really great idea. So what I do, I keep that tape on there for now, and I am going to just put some glue on the end of the rope and kind of let it sink down below the line of the scotch tape to kind of keep that in place. So now I'm just gonna take the rope and place it along the edge of the ear all the way around, and then I'm gonna put a piece of scotch tape around the rope right where I need to cut it, which will keep that edge from fraying. And then I'm gonna cut right in the center of the tape. So I'm gonna put more glue on the edge of the rope that I just cut to make sure that end doesn't fray. And then I'm gonna put glue all the way around the ear where the rope is gonna be. So the rope will stay in place. I'm gonna take off the scotch tape around the edge because the edges should be glued and not fraying now. And then I'm just gonna place it around the ear. And it doesn't really matter if you didn't cut the seam really pretty because the bow is actually gonna cover that whole area. So you wanna put the seam where the bow will be. So there's one ear with the rope. You're just gonna repeat the process for the second ear. Once you have the rope in place, we're gonna do our bow. We're just going to attach it with the red ribbon right onto the headband. So I just use this polka dot red ribbon. I'm just gonna cut off a little bit of it. So I'm gonna glue the ribbon right along the bottom of the headband so you can't see it. And once you have the red ribbon attached, you are done. This is what they look like when they are finished. These are some of the, my favorite ears that I have made. I'm so excited to get to wear these again on our Disney cruise, I just think that they're perfect for cruising. And I've actually heard from so many of you about these ears, how much you love them, that I'm considering starting an Etsy shop. So let me know in the comments below if you would actually purchase these, if it's something that you would be interested in. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and we will see you next time.